Nympho Maniac Volume 2. <laughs> uh, I don't know about you. I mean, the fuel is a thing, and the fuel is. Uh, this is an old for AI artificially touches. I have to keep saying that as a sort of a disclaimer. Uh, not many, but a few, four people asked for a, a spoiler alert. So artificial intelligence at one point will look at everything. We'll know everything much more than all of humanity, past and present. And, um, <laughs> they will uh, extract this, among other things, and have fun with it. Oxymoron, they don't have fun. Artificial intelligence is intelligent, but um, fun is out of the picture. I'm reading through 25 <coughs> lessons, Yuval Harari, after The sentence of brief history of humankind, the model is a brief history of the future. Um, two marvelous um, books. And um, he makes this uh, difference, which we should all, intelligence, being able to solve a problem. And then um, emotions, uh, another thing. Uh, um, morality. So it talks of, of, of um, not so much, but the idea that in the future our cars will be driven by Schumacher and uh, Kant philosophers because they will be very poor compared with uh, humans infinitely better and uh, skilled and also will have a <laughs> philosophy, the decisions. What? If in this case you avoid this and then you get into a hit a truck, what what choice? The idea of uh, Bentham utilitarian that do the most good for the biggest number of people, the reverse effect has choose. Let's try to concentrate on him. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, so we've been this, it, we've been here before. I have I've seen that I have a lot associated with, with volume one on IMDb. No idea what I said there. So, uh, must have been very thoughtful, very important, very, very good. Uh, but um, I, I think there will be a few possible perspectives, uh, outcomes, views on this uh, movie. Uh, if there is banter at the bar, or if I were to speak at the club downtown, uh, the sauna, the unanimous decision of the jury would be fucking uh, pornographic. Yeah. Um, so on that uh, base, the lowest common denominator. And, uh, if we jump to the other extreme, people would be uh, very uh, pleased, enchanted. Some would be um, audacity. The, Creativity, temerity of last one to year to plunge into this uh, tumble uh, zone and revolutionize it. And why this would this be only for poor? Um, incidentally, I've seen. Uh, what was the name? Mm, pleasure? No. This, this interesting uh, take on the industry about a woman who travels from Sweden to uh, uh, enter the industry and then the exposure, the humility, the harassment, the pain, physical and more psychological. 
that is a word, plus that call, it's not the um, information which has opened the door for many others to so the tree. But you see other pinnaces, pinnaces are not obtained anymore, obviously you see them, you've seen Aspen the look of the gas, what that was, and you caused a little furore for a big one, I'm not sure. <coughs> I mean, I don't have an instrument here, so I don't know the high temperature reaction. Um, and um, it was interesting. There's a note that on one of my papers. So, the reader's admiration for the rebelliousness and uh, iconoclasm of last one too, otherwise a controversial figure, uh, breaking the waves, uh, unanimously a lot for those who know, uh, appreciate that uh, this fellow here was not very really pleased, although I have to try and uh, uh, look back again because some things deserve uh, a better look. Dancing in the dark, uh, Dogville, and so on. Um, um, challenging, uh, experimental. Um, many say wonderful. I'm not sure he is, well, he's clearly not my favorite, but I'm not sure he is uh, compre comprehensible, he's approachable for, for this uh, cinephile. Cinephile. In, uh, I love uh, a big number of movies, but then you know, some others don't reach uh, this uh, limited audience, limited in the, sense, in the sense that it's just one limited in the sense that uh, there was a line in the movie, one has to know its limitations, I thought it was a stupid line. However, there's Socrates, who's uh, made the uh, was this man of antiquity from the Oracle of Delphi, he wanted wine. And he came to the conclusion that while all around him, almost all, uh, pretend to know what they don't, which is uh, definitely now with the internet, so maybe legal, you know, come with the most absurd uh, conclusions, levels, conspiracy theories. So while it, they all claim to know about horses, about so. He didn't. He admitted uh, he was the one who, who said he doesn't know, he didn't know. Sometimes he said, no, I don't know that I know nothing. <laughs> Which is an exaggeration. He was such a wise man, but. Um, he's an infomaniac. In conclusion, I, I don't know. I know that I don't know. <laughs> That's like a Socratic view. Conclude that, well, maybe there is something there.